So today we're doing a little bit of jar testing on a lagoon sewage treatment plant. And this is the water that is coming out of the settling section of the lagoon. And we've got a few different jars here, which I'll explain to you. The first jar on the far right is raw uh, lagoon effluent with no chemistry added. The second jar has coagulant added. The third jar has coagulant and flocculant. And then the final jar, the, the far one on the right, has coagulant, flocculant, and the microsand ballast to simulate the active flow process. So we've only been settling for 43 seconds so far. Um, here is the raw water. Water with coagulant added, which you can see the some of the flock formation developed. This has got coagulant and polymer added. We've got good strong flock there, and actually reasonable settling. And then here on the far right, we have the, the ballasted settling, coagulant, flocculant, and the microsand. And again, we've only been settling for just a little over a minute. And you can see we've got pretty complete settling in the uh, active flow jar. The traditional clarifier with flocculant addition will take, uh, in prior testing, it'll probably take 20 to 30 minutes to complete settling. Uh, the far jar on the left really doesn't settle at all, given even several hours. And the one with just coagulant will settle out in about uh, in about an hour's time. It'll make good water. Again, we'll spin up the the active flow jar to show you again how quick it settles. <laughs> There you go. There's the difference between conventional settling and ballasted settling with ActiFlow.